Well, I'm Rob Lamb, and I run this place. So this is a light source. This is the brightest light in Canada. I think, I think the thing that separates light sources is you have this broad range of people. We have lots of scientists, lots of engineers. We have, we have lots of accountants. We have a whole range, it's like a little community all wrapped up around a beating heart. We use the light to observe, mostly to observe. We're there to read nature at its finest detail. At the same time, we can use that light to make other things. We can now use this ultra bright, the world's brightest light, to actually make medical isotopes. We don't need a nuclear reactor. We can make, make medical isotopes right here at the same time as someone else is trying to image cancer cells in their finest detail. So we're looking at both the discovery and we're also looking at the application. So my, my big interest is in that nexus, that connection between science and technology to see how I can improve that connection. We have the world's best scientists coming in here every day of the week. This is the 10 year anniversary of the Canadian Light Source. So we've had 10 years of development. We've grown, the number of people who come here have grown, the number of discoveries have grown, and as I said earlier, the number of things that are spinning out of this place. It's just amazing. That's the key to this place in the future. It's to take the great science that we are actually seeing to help that translate into the technology that we see every day when we leave this building. And I think that's the key to this place.